Welcome back, DOG fam. We're back at it one more time for the alternate ending. So we're going to lie now to Adler about everything that he didn't want us to lie about. Because you remember, he's the mole. Well, at least I think he's the mole. Breaking a subject's will and erasing their mind is a difficult and painful process. That's a small price to pay. The CIA's mind Merry Christmas to everyone, by the way. It's December 25th. I hope you guys got everything that you asked for. And if you didn't, maybe next year. Don't worry. We have a job to do. We have a job to do. We have a job to do. Gotta make sure I hide my cup because I'm not sponsored. It appears the subject's programming is beginning to take hold. We've got a job to do. We've known each other for years. Fought together, bled together, been through the hell of Vietnam together. We got a job to do. And now the training's complete. We just need to give the subject a name. Bell. So let's see. Hopefully we are able to access the alternate ending by lying. Not sure if it'll work, but let's give it a shot. Ten years later. Oh, wow. I think something got stuck. There we go. Yeah, I forgot about that. He's coming too. Bell, no more fucking around. What did Perseus say? Where is he? Okay. So now, what's what you're going through me? now is nothing compared to what we're gonna lie now. If you don't start cooperating, bullshit is what your whole life will amount to if you don't come clean. Tell us where Perseus is. All right. What did you do to me? We gave you a second chance when you were shit out of luck. Now, we just want some assistance in return. Bell, you were one of Perseus's agents. His associate, Arash Kardavar, turned on you at the airstrip in Turkey. Now they're gonna lie. Left you for dead. Now I remember what this guy reminds me from, from that movie, Old School. This, you know. <laughs> Here's what you don't know. Perseus won't be there. None of these hired guns are going to leave Duva alive. We'll dump their bodies in the forest. Then we will move the weapons to Volkov in Berlin. From there, we fly to Solovetsky. But I have other plans for you. Perseus thinks too highly of I don't want the competition. Okay, so that's still the same. Obviously, because they gotta take them we into there. the interrogation we area there. that we're going through right now. Sorry, I'm making sure that there's no neighbors cutting grass or anything like that. You're lying. You put this shit in my head. The CIA reinvented you, Bell. I hope I went the right way. We needed to give you a new identity <clears throat> to replace the old. Sims and I both wanted you to be CIA. You didn't resist it as much as we thought you might. And we were able to utilize your language and cryptography skills as an added bonus. The bigger challenge was your memory. The CIA's MK Ultra program used Atlas missions in Vietnam as a template. We needed you to have that shared experience, that lifelong bond, to establish trust. Oh, you people are sick. I will. I was never really in Vietnam. How did it change my? Okay. Are your hands clean, Bell? No, count yourself lucky. You've only had those memories for a few months. Me? I've been living with them for over a decade. Interrogation didn't work with you, but thanks to MK Ultra's research, we had a backup plan. 
Okay, so I think this is where the line begins. We could lead you to a place where you give everything up. I don't think so. You're still holding back on us, and we are gonna get it out of you. We have a job to do. Bell, we've got come a job. We've got a job to do. You've got a job to do. If you remember, that was a key word he would the always say to trigger something. Mind, it didn't get us everything we needed. Your innermost secrets were always locked behind a door. Bell, I realize you probably hate us right now. What we've done to you. I just need you to fully understand the stakes. Nah. What you do right now is not about me. It's not about you. It's about millions of other fucking people. It's about stopping someone who, in the end, has no true allegiance to anyone other than himself. So tell me, where is Perseus? Once we control the Queen of Mars, we will detonate them all for the safety of Solovetsky. Solovetsky, and I am not going to tell you that. This is your chance to find out who you really are, Bill. Where is Perseus? From the safety okay. of Solovetsky. Duga, the radar is in Duga. Hey, hey, hey. Sims, get Washington. Everyone else gear up. We're leaving now. Okay, so let now let's see if the end the final mission actually changes because we lied to him. Choice, Bill. Come on. You're still one of us. Okay. So he's thinking that we're still well that I'm set up ambush at Duga. Aha. Uh -huh. Alright. Adler. So Right. Yeah. We'll leave within the hour. Ooh -hoo. Let's see. Five years ago, NATO intelligence detected a powerful signal of unknown origin. The new signal created radio disruptions worldwide. Not to mention all kinds of conspiracy theories. NATO quickly tracked it to this facility in the Soviet Republic of Ukraine. The Duga Radar Array. It's an over-the-horizon radar system. Big improvement over their old missile defense tech. It uses a lot of juice. Could be used to broadcast any kind of long-range signal. So far, like we're nation codes to every green light. We were able to access the sec exactly the alternate the ending, About and I hope that's the way it continues. Between the cities of Pripyat and Chernobyl, it's nothing but thick forest for miles around. A perfect hiding spot for Perseus. We'll have to drop you in a little further out. No recon, no heavy support. Just a light infiltration squad. Shouldn't be a problem. Just point the way. Bell came through for us in the nick of time. I never doubted it. <laughs> yeah, after you betrayed him Adler, still on the final I showdown. You bastard. Same. I haven't seen shit. All right. Everyone converge on the gate. All right. <clears throat> you sure you're not forgetting something, Bell? Yeah. Ashes to ashes. There's nothing here. This can't be the right place. We didn't see anything on our side either. It's him. Fucking lied to us. That true, Bell? You pull us out to the middle of nowhere, rushes so Perseus can detonate those nukes. Signal ambush, you underestimated me. Goodbye, Adler. You were a fool. Unless it stopped, the United States will harm the world. Let's do it. Alright. Eliminate your former team. Alternate ending.
Ah, shoot. I forgot not to shoot the bad guys because I'm the bad guy now. Yeah, okay. Sorry, sweetie. No hard feelings. Mason, see ya, buddy. We gotta wait. We gotta leave Adler to the end. Woods, see ya, Woods. for Adler now. Come out, come out wherever you are. The cat becomes the mouse. Okay, move. Oh, bro, are you serious? Oh. Glad to see you still care. My no hesitation. No. Always love that about you. That's it, son. Checkpoint reach. Okay, so now what? <clears throat> you remember my face, don't you? Solovetsky, stand by for the detonation order. I think you deserve this moment, comrade. Let's see. I wish we could return to Solovetsky to watch it all unfold, but that chapter is closed now. He's gonna try to We begin to the next one together. You did well. Will there be another game? Hmm. And to think, after all this time, they still believe I'm Perseus. <laughs> As if Perseus could ever be an individual working alone. So American. Ah. We'll need a new home now. That's a little weird. So is Percy a person or is it a group of people? Even if we made the best choice for the future of our homeland. Hmm. Yet, for humanity, their eyes will be as clouded as ours once were. Come. There is still much to be done. Let's see what he's gonna make us do now. Okay, so... I'm starting to rethink this whole mole thing with Adler. My God. But it is kind of confusing, right? Like nukes did he detonate. Leave your thoughts on the comments below. Do you guys really think Does anyone know the bombs that Adler was the mole? And this guy is just saying, you know, whatever he said to make it seem like he had nothing to do with them? Could be a cover up. You and Vice President Bush are to be moved to secure locations immediately. I want any business related to this thing erased forever. Everything. Can you make that happen? Of course. It's already begun. That was a little weird. Why would the president want everything deleted like it never happened? We will watch Europe burn. We will watch the Empire of the United States collapse under its own weight. A world with two superpowers will become a world with one. The Soviet Union. 
and if the leaders of this new world order squander the opportunity we have provided them, then they too will be replaced. So, that's the conclusion Kasim of... Javadi. He fell into the Hang hands on. of your former CIA friends. Kasim is too soft. I will need you to personally supervise his erasure. I'll let you guys listen to this. It is a shame you had to kill Anton Volkov. He was our most valuable GDR asset. But perhaps with the fall of the West, it will not prove so great a blow. You say that Eliezer Azoulay perished in Cuba. We will not miss that one. His interference with our Middle East assets will be a distraction no more. As for the rest, it was a pleasure eliminating them by your side. Unfortunately, our key asset within the U.S., Robert Aldrich, was killed. Our spiring there is still intact. But we will need to rebuild and find new leadership. The death of Major Vadim Rudnik is a terrible loss for post-nuclear Europe. He was to help shepherd in the Soviet-aligned future. Which route did you guys Hopefully take initially with the game? Did you guys go there. with, you know, agreeing to everything that Adler was saying? And that way, you know, got you to the point where Bell ends up getting shot by Adler? Or did you go with the line route like we did today? Let me know in the comments down below which ending do you guys like the most. I I'm pretty disappointed. There you go. Another mission right there. I'm pretty disappointed with the way... You know not lying to adler went because he shot him so what does that make you think it makes you think that adler's the mole and because bell's catching up to every single little bullshit type of thing that they did to him he had to wipe him out you know get rid of him kind of like you know don't want to say it but that's i feel like that's how things go but that's just my two cents and then the way that it happened with uh perseus or Perseus, the group, you know, they set off all the nuclear explosions and everything, and the, the the collapse of the United States happened. But then the president wanted it all wiped out like it never happened. So what does that make you think? Was the president involved in it too? I don't know. Let me know in the comments down below your thoughts for this particular mission, which was Ashes to Ashes, episode 12 of Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War. Thanks for joining me and playing this game. I had so much fun. I hope you guys did too. I'm Tech. Till next time, peace out.